Bubba James, what's up, man? Sean Collins from Sanal. Thanks for reaching out. For those that didn't see your initial response, you shared that one of the challenges you face when creating content is a constant fan noise running in your workspace and it finds its way into your recordings. I wanted to respond right away, so I just grabbed a conference room here at Sanal and sort of impromptu, I'm recording on the uh, UB440 and a MacBook, but certainly not an ideal environment. You're going to hear people walking by in front of our, our door here and I just wanted to let you know that I can completely relate, and this is a challenge that a lot of content creators face. As far as solutions, I have a few, the simplest of which would be to turn off the fan. This would eliminate the noise source completely, and I know you mentioned not having air conditioning, so while it might be tedious, you could just turn the fan on and off between takes so that you don't start melting into your control room floor. But I'm guessing that your situation is probably a little more complex than that. If you're not in control of the fan, ask your building if they'd be able to accommodate your recording schedule. If they're unwilling or unable to help, the second best solution would be to isolate yourself from the noise. Ideally, you'd build a room within your room, complete with rock wool insulation, MDF panels, and absorption foam. Now, Bubba, I don't know the budget of the projects you're working on, but I'm going to go out on the limb and assume that you want to find the least expensive and fastest option. Uh, and in this case, sound or moving blankets are going to be your best friend. Just get a few and clamp or drape them over light stands or really anything sturdy that you can find and build a sort of makeshift vocal booth. If you're shooting video and you don't want them in the shot, just build them outside of the frame and start creating layers of separation between your mic and the fan. Now this method probably won't completely kill the noise, but it should get you down to manageable levels. For safety though, just don't smother the fan with blankets and please be careful, especially if you're dealing with something that's industrial grade. If you'd like a more sophisticated take on this concept, look into isolation panels or sound gobos. Now, if you can't stop the noise or separate yourself from it, your last stand might be to try and extract it from the recording using noise reduction software. Most digital audio workstations or uh, editing programs come with a noise reduction VST or plugin, but it's a trade-off. You might be able to wipe out some of the unwanted sound, but often you'll end up with audio that sounds kind of anemic. If your fan generates a deep hum, you could try a low pass filter that'll sort of roll off the, those unwanted frequencies from your recording. And a final option might be to bring in some music under your track that will help mask those tones. Bubba, thank you for sharing your experience. I hope I've been of some help. If you're not Bubba and you're watching this, please share your tips, tricks, or questions in the comments below, and we really appreciate it. Thanks.